Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Math 10C, Chapter 4, Section 4, Factoring AX Squared plus BX plus C. Now, one little trick I want to remind you of is check for common factors first before you factor up these horrible quadratics. 6x squared minus 21x plus 9, you note, divide everything by 3. So this is 3 times 6 divided by 3 is 2x squared. And 21 divided by 3 is minus 7x plus 3. So you're actually factoring 2x squared minus 7x plus 3. So factors of 2, 1, and 2. Now the question is, what are the factors of 3? Well, your first thought is 1 and 3, but that gives you positive numbers. That gives you everything positive, so that doesn't work. So it must be negative 1 and negative 3, so and minus, excuse me, minus 1 and minus 3, so 2 times 1 is minus 2x, 1 and minus 3x, no, that gives you minus 5x, so that doesn't work. So, so 1x, minus 1, 1x, minus 3, and 2x minus 1. 1 times minus 1 is minus 1x, 2 times 3 is minus 6x, and there we go. Yeah, so this is 3 times 1 mi 1x, sorry. There we go. So once again, you got to guess and check. Practice, practice, practice. Now, 24h squared minus 20h minus 24. Uh, 24, we can divide everything by 2, or we can divide everything by 4, can't we? So that's 6h squared minus 20 divided by 5h minus 6. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. 6h squared minus 5h minus 6. Okay, so what are the factors of 6, 1 and 6, or 2 and 3. Um, I honestly don't know, so I'm going to go 1h, 6h. Now, what are the factors of minus 6? 1 and 6. Now, since it's minus, plus 1, minus 6, does that work? Minus 6h, 6h, nope, that gives us 0h. So, 6h squared minus 5h minus 6, 1h, 6h minus 6 plus 1, 1h minus 6, woohoo, that works. 1h minus 6, 1h minus 6 times 6h plus 1. Now, as lucky there, you'll notice four chances here, and sometimes you use them all and then some. Now, here's some evil, horrible ones. Well, not evil, just lots and lots of practice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, I'm going to do these one at a time. Come back, and we... So, I'm gonna, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start 14y squared minus 13y plus 3. Minus 13y plus 3. We'll come back and compare answers, okay? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this one sucked. Okay, um, factors of 14 are 1 and 14 and 2 and 7. And the factors of 3 are 1 and 3. And then you notice the minus sign here, which means it's minus 1 and minus 3 just to screw with you. Anyway, so I started plugging those numbers in. 1 and 14 and minus 1 and 3 didn't work. So 1y minus 1, 14y minus 3 didn't work. 1y minus 3 and 14y minus 1 didn't work. Then I got 2y minus 1 and 7y minus 3, which does work. Practice, practice, practice. So I'm going to do 10r squared minus 33r minus 7. We can come back and compare answers, OK? Minus 7. Now, before we get going, what are the factors of 10? 
one times 10, two times seven. So we're two times, God help me, two times five. Now, what are the factors of minus seven? Well, minus one times seven or one times minus seven. So poopy, I got a lot of examples to do. Anyway, pause the recording, come back and compare answers. Okay, so I started doing this. I went one hour and 10 hour and minus one and seven. Then I went one hour minus one and 10 hour minus seven and one hour plus seven and 10 hour minus one. And you'll notice neither time I came anywhere close. So one and 10, I don't think works. If you look at it, you're getting in the first one here, you're getting 7R minus 10R minus 3, not 33. And then the next one, you're getting minus 1 minus 70 minus, oh, sorry, plus 70, sorry, 69, which is nowhere close to minus 33. So I don't think the 1 and the 10 are right. So I'm just going to skip it and go on to the next. I suspect it's a 2R and a 5R. So then I'm going to go plus 7 minus 1. 5 times 7 is 35 minus 2. Okay, that gives me plus 33R. So I think that gives me my answer. I got it backwards. 10R squared minus 33R minus 7. 2R minus 7, 5R plus 1. That's 2R, 5R minus 35. Yes, minus 35 plus 2 is minus 33. So that's my answer there. 2R minus 7 and 5R plus 1. Doable, yes. And you notice even me with many years experience is going, I had to do that four freaking Jeezly times. All right, practice, 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 practice. I'm going to do one more. Four x squared plus four x minus fifteen, and I'll make one of the other four your quiz question tomorrow. If you actually, or quiz question today, if you actually watch the video. Okay. So, four x squared plus. 4x minus 15. Now, double check, make sure I copied it out correctly because I'm getting old. Plus 4x minus 15. All right. So, how to factor this? What are the factors of 4? 1 times 4 or 2 times 2. The factors of 15? 1 times 15 or 3 times 5. So it's negative minus 1 or minus 3. Crap, lots of choices here. Poopy, 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 poopy. Okay. Now, just as an aside, guys, the reason I'm doing this in a series of steps, you notice the middle term is four, small. But if you do enough of these, you realize that big numbers, you do not work out well when you multiply them. You don't get small numbers when you start with like a 15. So I'm willing to bet it's not 1 and 15 or 15 and, and 1. So let's try smaller numbers. So I'm trying to do a little bit of mental math or estimation here. One of the reasons we did the table of values, or sorry, table of values, multiplication tables. All right, so I'm going to go minus 3 and 5. Now, I'm going to get numbers close. So, well, 1x, 4x. 1 times 5 is 5x. 4 times 2 is minus 12x. That gives us what? S minus 7x. Not bad. Close. Oops, let's try. One X, what was I, okay. I say 
5 plus 5 4x minus 3. 5, 4 is a 20x minus 3x. Now that gives us 17. That doesn't work. Um, if I went minus 5 and plus 3, that would give us uh, minus 17. So I don't think it's the 1x and 4x. As I said, I'm just guessing and checking here. Because, oh, you poopy head, I said purple. So, by minus 3 and 5 again, 2x and 2x. So this is minus 6x, 10x. Woohoo! That works! 2x minus 3 times 2x plus 5. Yes, that works. All right. So good luck. If you've got any questions, shoot me an email. Otherwise, I'll see you in class tomorrow.